You used to get like fifty dollars a night. Uh yeah. Mm -hmm. That's if you balling. Like if you're a good feature, because I used to feature for DL way back in the day. Um, I could name a couple of clubs that he would remember. Um, Club Mahogany mm -hmm. and um I think that was way out in Riverside and um and just some other clubs. Uh Club Mahogany had a dance floor that was like um oh Club Mon Club Monopoly. I'm sorry, Club Monopoly. They had a floor that was like a Monopoly board. I think it was Club Monopoly. Anyway, um uh we uh, uh I, I would get when I when I started like making some noise and getting high, fifty dollars was about as much as you could expect. Okay, okay. Um, so when you first started, I'm assuming you had another job. I'm assuming you didn't do comedy full time. What else? What were you doing in terms of work? Well, when I first started doing comedy, I was working as at a bank. I had banking experience. Okay, lots and lots of banking experience. <laughs> So um, that was um, why I uh, knew that the bank that I was working at was about to fail. And being the hustler that I thought I was, I said, well, I'm going to get some of this money before this bank goes to hell. So I robbed the bank, embezzlement, if you want to call it, that I work at. I got away with it for over 10 years, then I finally got popped by the feds and I went to a uh, jail and I did four months and 18 days on a year bid at Twin Towers Correctional Facility in Los Angeles because I, I went to Oakland. They absconded me in Oakland and brought me back to LA. Um, yeah, I had lots of banking experience, office experience, administrative experience, but every job I worked, I found out a way to scam the shit. And I've only just ever had one desire and that was to have money. And right. It was a by any means necessary type thing. So then when I, because um, I was already on television, had already done Comic View, because when I started Comic View, there was no Def Jam, no Comic View. Right. Black comedians didn't have a um, platform to be on television. Right. So, uh, uh, regularly. So, um, uh, but then they did, and I had done that, and it was way after that that I went to jail, because if I hadn't took as much money as I did, I would have got away with it. Because 10 years is the uh, statute of limitations. And it was over 10 years before I got popped. But I took so much money that it was a felony. So it never went away until they came and got me. I did my time. But I'm reformed now. I would not take a dollar off a pool table. I pay my fucking taxes and all that good shit. Uh, my car is registered, the insurance, my gun is registered, all that stuff. Legal, eagle. Well, I don't know if I'm supposed to have a gun, but anyway. What we